Hi everybody. In this video we are doing some final wiring on stuff that's around the engine that's been sort of maybe to get to. Uh, one we are going to be setting up or cutting, crimping, and finalizing the uh, spark plug, lower spark plug wires. Now the EFI kit comes with that great silicone spark plug wire. The problem is one end has 90 degree plug-ins on it, which is fine. Those plug into the coil packs, no problem. But the kit only then comes with more 90 degree end plugs. Well, I mean, there's nothing wrong with terminals, but I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. But it just has sort of a weird shape around the cylinder. So instead of using the 90 degree plugs, we're going to use some straight plugs. You're going to see me... Uh, there you can see one right there. They're great because you can you just pull straight out of the plug and it's got a nice hard rubber really long sleeve and that sleeve can go up and cover the entire spark plug as well so we like those. Besides that it's just CHT probes which is you know uh, cut the wire back, strip and expose the two wires, strip each one of those, crimp a ring terminal on that and then screw those into the ring terminals that are at the end of the CHT probes. The CHT probes are cool because their ring terminal uh, terminals at the end uh, actually can have like, uh, they're threaded. You can screw stuff onto them. I'm still trying to find those. I can't find those in real life, but those are awesome. It's also just a matter of making sure that you put the fire sleeve on those first. They, they each come with a piece of fire sleeve to, co to cover the terminals. And then you just use a couple of zip ties on the end of those and they're protected so all right while you watch me do that I got a couple of quick rants we haven't had a rant in a while uh, to the property management company that deals with my uh, wife and I we have a, own a rental house uh, who couldn't be bothered to get me my 1099 miscellaneous tax form for 2021 until yesterday four days before tax day uh, yeah you're gonna have to pay for my bar tab after making me complete my taxes at zero hour you schmucks all I'm going to say about that. It's not like I don't have things to do, like build. Uh, speaking of drinking, uh, to all the wineries in Napa Valley who have uh, taken the normally enviable task of going for wine tastings because you actually wanted to buy wine and have started peddling a visit to their facilities to... What's the word I'm looking for? Instagram whores. Pardon my French. Go f*** yourselves. I'm not paying $40 to sit around tables full of depraved geeks and squinty whores and flat brim fedoras posing for pictures and going on about how expensive everything is getting while they guzzle wine and snack on nuts. I'm not doing it. All I want is a darkly lit tasting room, right, and someone to deftly sell me some bottles of that sweet, sweet liquor. Look, I, I understand if you need to charge because you got people working there, and that's fine. But at least do it so that it's like, look, tasting's 40 bucks. If you buy a bottle, we waive the fee. Now, a lot of places still do that, but a lot of them don't. It's You know what it is? It's basically the brew pub for, <laughs> for California. That's what it is. It's California brew pub, just a winery. All right, so now that we've got these sort of in place, I still haven't done the top plugs yet. Uh, we'll get into that. I'm actually just finishing the baffling up now, actually, in real life, and so we'll wind up putting the uh, top plugs in there. Again, we're going to use the long straight end probes because they fit, and why not? All right, the only other thing I've got left on that side, you can see the Bowden cable going forward. It's going to activate the or actuate the alternate air entry on the side of the snorkel, which we'll get into much later than that. So, all right, in the next video, let's see what we've got coming up. In the next video, oh crap, we're putting the wings on. All right, thank you for joining me. See you soon.